body bags were whore lies. Who is this irresistible creature who has an insatiable love for the dead? Hey guys, happy Thursday. This is your fried chick speaking. Okay, so uh, my pick this week is a little bit random, but I've gone for a British one, or Irish. Set in Ireland. I think it's British though. So yeah, I've gone for Grabbers. Um, I haven't actually had anybody speak to me about this movie. I only know sort of one other person on the internet that mentioned it. Um, but I've got to admit, this is probably one of those ones that you should that you should pick up. It's, it's not too bad, but there we go. So this came out in 2012 and it's a very, very simple plot. It's a pretty easy going movie. Uh, basically a bunch of sea monsters um, land. I don't know where they came from. They didn't make it clear. Uh, a bunch of sea monsters uh, end up off the coast of Ireland on this tiny remote island and um, basically just uh, go on a bit of a killing spree really. That's all they're there to do. Uh, the townspeople are unaware of this except for our main characters who uh, include a drunk, another drunk and a woman. That's pretty much it. Uh, yeah, so um, after they find some sort of whale carcasses, uh, they realise that there is some creature out there attacking them, killing them and clearly there's a big problem on this island. Now, they realise quite quickly on in the movie that... Uh, uh, one of the townspeople is very, very drunk and is attacked by one of these sea monsters who they call Grabbers and it didn't kill him because the alcohol in his blood made him sick, it made him toxic to the Grabbers. So basically the whole movie is these three people going around trying to protect everybody by just like organising a massive party in a pub and getting them all pissed. They have to stay pissed for the entire movie so that they can save themselves. <laughs> like, who came up with this concept? It's brilliant. Um, I don't really remember any of the like the actors' names. They're not they're not too well known, but for those of you on my side of the pond, you'll probably recognise one of them from uh, British comedy. I think he's been in a few sitcoms. Um, and the other main character is in Being Human. I know they made a US version of that, but obviously this is the British guy. He played the werewolf in it. So you'll recognise him. I don't really recognise anybody else. There is a picture on the back of all of them. And yeah, that's pretty clear. So yeah, that's basically the plot of the movie. They have to uh, try and protect the townspeople without letting them know that there's a load of monsters. And they do this by organising a massive party and giving everybody free drinks to keep them intoxicated so that they won't get eaten. Uh, hilarity ensues. It's, it's kind of one of those horror comedies, but... I didn't, I didn't like it as much as some other horror comedies. I mean, Shaun of the Dead's a bit of genius. This is kind of trying to do something similar, but it didn't really have the same impact. Um, I think the problem that I found with it was that there was a big lack of uh, soundtrack. There wasn't much music that kind of helped the movie. Um, it's pretty bare when it comes to the soundtrack. So it, it kind of lost a bit of impact for me, and I think that might be the reason why. Yeah, so pretty quick review. That's pretty much it. If you want to see a funny horror where there's a bunch of sea monsters <laughs> and uh, a bunch of idiots running around getting drunk for the whole movie, then there you go. There are some pretty funny lines here and there between our uh, female and male uh, characters I must admit I don't really remember I, I have only watched this once I will say it's not like I don't like it but I have only watched it once but um, I do remember laughing out loud quite a few times so um, yeah if you're into horror comedies um, or you fancy maybe just a bit of off the cuff splatter gore here and there then this is for you go for it grabbers I'm pretty sure you can get it in both regions if not it will only be region two sorry people but yeah, give it a go and I'll see you next week. Don't know what I'm doing yet, but I'll see you then. Bye.